lust has a reputation for being the flame we jump into. Think of 50 Shades of Grey or your classic bad boy or bad girl who's all games in danger with no strings attached. But according to leading love expert Dr. Helen Fisher, lust is the essential first stage of love. Without the desire of wanting someone first, we cannot experience intimacy. So, how do we know if we're still stuck in the initial stage of attraction or ready to transition into something more meaningful and long-lasting? Here are six key differences between lust versus love. 1. Lust is driven by physical connection, but love comes from emotional connection. It all comes down to our brain. Which areas are being activated when you hang out with your partner? Research shows that lust lights up the regions associated with reward and motivation, whereas love stimulates the areas that help you empathize. Lust happens when you and your partner don't have much to talk about but have great sex. This is common for two people who haven't been dating for too long. But love, on the other hand, happens when you appreciate your partner for more than just their looks and can spend meaningful time with them. This is what ultimately forms the start of a deep and serious relationship. 2. Over time, love grows stronger, whereas lust becomes weaker. Psychologist and sex therapist Shannon Chavez states that as attachment and bonding grow over time, so does love. But lust is more temporary and fades when sexual desire fades away. If a relationship is based solely on lust, there is inevitably no foundation to fall in love with each other. Lust feels like an exciting roller coaster but can only be sustained by physical pleasure. When the real work kicks in, the dynamic either transitions into love or the relationship begins to fall apart. 3. Lust is based on fantasies. Love, however, operates on the ground of reality. Have you ever looked back on past relationships and wondered how on earth you two got together? I don't know about you, but I sure do. Imagination can come in handy when life gets mundane, but more often than not, it's like a double-edged sword. When you like the idea of someone more than who's actually in front of you, it can cause you to miss a lot of red flags. Relationship experts state that there is only so much time before reality sets in and makes you realize that your partner has faults just like you and that your expectations were unfair. 4. In lust, you're romantic partners, but in love, you're lifelong friends. Psychiatrist Judith Orloff discovered that people in lust are just lovers, but true love is built on the foundation of a strong friendship. Sure, two people can agree to be in a relationship, go on fun dates, and even meet each other's family. But if they lack compromise, communicate poorly, and fail to understand each other, the prospect of having a future together is very low. 5. Lust is all about thrill-seeking, whereas love is the pursuit of stability. Researchers have looked at MRI scans of people in lust and found that their brains look similar when an addict gets a fix of cocaine. Sounds intense, right? But that's why infatuation is not likely to last as long as love. The drug effects wear off when you can no longer satiate your sexual desires. Whereas lust is about instant gratification, love is the relentless search for stability. 6. Lust is selfish, but love comes from a selfless place. When you love someone, you focus more on helping them reach their goals and care about their health and well-being. Lust, on the other hand, is all about your own wants, like boosting your ego when you're next to your attractive partner or simply fulfilling your sexual desires. In order to move from the initial stage of lust to love, you must determine whether you could see yourself doing favors or making sacrifices for your partner. Do you think you're in lust or in love? We hope that this video helped you differentiate between the two. Remember that just because you might only be experiencing lust doesn't mean that your feelings can't develop into love. Please share your thoughts with us below. Also be sure to subscribe to our channel for more helpful content and thank you for watching!